Alrighty, so what is up and what is poppin' party, people? As you guys can see, it is your host with the most, Paul Cantu, reporting live and direct with a new pickups video. I haven't done too many of these recently, but I got two huge packages in the mail, one from a fan named Mark, another from a homie who I actually did the painting for a couple weeks back, Luis. Both of these big ass, massive, ginormous ass interstellar packages are full of awesome, amazing vintageness slash other dope apparel. So let's crack into it right now. All right, last corner, we got this, we got this. All right. So first the balls, before I open this up, I wanna say thank you to the homie Mark. He just hit me up for no reason and said he has something to send me. So uh, I was like, yeah, go ahead. Do you have an Instagram? Do you have anything I can shout you out with? He told me no, he's just a dope individual who wanted to send me some stuff. So that is sick and I definitely hook up homies who hook me up. So first we have this uh, nice paper towel. As you guys can see, it is very crispy. No come on it whatsoever. It's an amazing thing. Oh yeah, then we got these little packaging bags right here. I'm about to pop one of these. All right, so the first thing homie sent me was this all embroidered Milwaukee Bucks jersey, number 22. Peep the threading on that, baby. This thing is straight professionally embroidered. As you guys can tell, this is official Reebok licensed product right here. And it got Bambi's dad's horns right there. We got straight murked by a motherfucker hunter. And uh, yeah, man, thank you so much, Mark. This is a really sick jersey. So uh, shouts outs to you, homie. And then he also threw in some more paper towels, which are a must have in the cocaine colorway. And then bam, homie threw in some Air Maxes right here, size 12. Look at these Johns, baby. Some no so action, even though there is so action right there. But these are like really freaking fresh and they're like a bread colorway. So these will go really well with a lot of items I have. I could even wear them with my Iverson fit right now. So these are hella beautiful right there. I mean, look at that meshing, baby. You could catch hella small fish in this. But thank you once again for the Air Maxes. And then last but not least, Bam! He sent me these bad boys right here. These are beautiful. They definitely could even go with what I'm wearing right now. And these are gonna go super sexily with some Cowboys gear that your boy got in hand. So thank you so much for these shoes once again. I mean, as you guys can tell, we got a metallic probe right there on deck. We got this zoom air on the inside right there. Some beautiful tumble leather off a polar bear lamb's ass on deck. We got some uh, panther pussy once again right here. The interior is a nice midnight navy black blue. But these shoes are sexy as hell. Once again, skin off a blue whale. These are delicious. So I'm very appreciative of everything you sent me in this package. Shout out to you, homie. I'm definitely gonna use those paper towels like a boss. Y'all. Yeah. Alrighty, so now getting into the second package from my homie Luis, aka Luis Likes Turtles. As you guys can tell, we got some, some peakage right here. So the mailman was trying to like low-key creep into my motherfucking box, but you ain't made it, bruh. Or maybe it's just a possum like curious as hell. But whipping out the skizzers once again, let's crack open this box as well. Oh man, homie went in with that kindergarten handwriting right here. Oh my God, I already see flame in here. I need to chill out. Yo, Paul, first off, thanks again for the painting. Here you have a box full of shoes, hats, jerseys, etc. I have another jacket that I wanted to send you in parentheses, Versace. <laughs> But I couldn't find it. As soon as I find it, I'll send it your way. Cool, thanks once again. Yo, man, Luis. So shout out to you, Luis. Thank you for this meaningful ass uh, letter right here. Straight up, third grade handwriting status from head to toe, but ain't nobody mad at it, because it's from the heart. I'm gonna put that shit on my mini fridge. All right, but let's crack into these items right now. All right, so let's see. <laughs> oh, shit. This is dope. As you guys can tell, we got the... Uh, this beautiful religious print Virgin Mary shirt and this high fashion colorway right here. Team HFV, high fashion vintage all day. This thing is beautiful. Man, he left the price tag, Jesus Christ swag on it. Five doll hairs for this bad boy. Luis, you're doing too much, homie. You're doing too much. This thing is sick. I'm really happy about it. <laughs> I'm like super happy right now. This is crazy excitement. But they're like some fire freaking flame hats in here. So let's get into it right now. Homie hooked it up. Like, do you guys see this? Homie straight hooked your boy up with some hats. So let's get into the first one right now. We all, I'm like drooling. Fuck, cut. All right, so the first hat in the mix is this good wrench, mother freaking black and white shark tooth right here. I love vintage shark tooth snapbacks, love flame. We got this black and yellow, black and yellow. Race Rock Orlando snapback right here. This is a splash, a vintage logo athletic splash. This thing is amazing. Once again, I love having hats that aren't team related so I can wear them with different team items. 
So really sick vintage hat once again right there. He threw in this vintage Izod hat right here. Super sick, super classy, all red. Green under brim right there. Curved brim, it has this nice little support beam on the inside. But look at that, man. Look at that crest right there. That crest is just unfuckwittable. All right, homie also sent me this Florida State Seminoles right here, like graffiti print. It's by Top of the World right there. This is heavily vintage, really dope, and really sexy. I know he didn't throw in the Jacksonville Jaguar straight assassinated by Tarzan. Fall on so small, you seem so strong. Snap back right here in the splash colorway. Oh my god, this is beautiful. Green underbrim right there, Jolly Green Giant. Clean on the inside. This is by Logo Athletic, as you guys can tell. NFL Pro line in the red, white, and blue. This is a sexy ass hat, Luis. Thank you so much, homie. You the man. Next up, we got some scripts. We got a Minnesota Timberwolves. This hat actually looks pretty dirty, like it was found like straight in the woods or something. But nothing your boy cannot restore. This is a script. It is vintage. It has the NBA logo right there. Oh, look at that bird. Peep the feather count on that boy. Shake them tail feathers. He threw in this logo athletic shark tooth as well in the mix. I probably won't rock this while I'm in college because they're in the same conference as UT. But this is a sexy hat. You guys can't lie. That bird is on him right there. He threw in a new school Mitchell and Ness snapback right here in the mix, which is this uh, Chicago Bulls like nylon galaxy print snapback. Pretty dope. Probably gonna rock this with the galaxy jacket I have. But uh, yeah, that's cool too. Threw in another plain snapback, Florida print on deck all over Tropical Vacation Stilo. Bam! And he also tossed in this super sexy Orlando Magic Splash right here in the black, blue, and white colorway. Once again, vintage. Once again, NBA. But this thing is sexy as hell, and it is magical. And then he also threw in this Elks hat right here. And this hat is actually delicious. A really cool design. Red, white, and blue. Once again, American flag colorway. And look at that, dude. Skinned off a sperm whale. They made this leather strap with a gold buckle on it. This is beautiful. I definitely will probably rock this backwards. So thank you once again, Luis for the huge vintage hat haul. That could be a video in and of itself. What? All right, baby. He threw in the Timberwolves jersey that I can rock with the Timberwolves snapback. It just keeps getting better and better. Who's the player on, on deck? It is uh, Dolores, numero siete right there. Dolores Holmes. Dolores ese, vatos locos forever, Holmes. Oh my gosh, he knows how I like that Western wear for real though. Homie threw in this majestic horse plateau desert wrangler button up in the navy blue colorway with black pearls under this is the parts of the caribbean stilo from head to toe he also threw in this phillies dead stock majestic baseball jersey heavily perforated once again so if you're sweating cats and dogs and balls this will definitely be a good jersey to rock i love red jersey so i actually could throw it over a hoodie thank you for this again so woo. fuck why do i not attend florida state so homie threw in this apex one Huge shoulder patch, Florida State jacket. I'm sorry you guys got your asses beat, but this jacket is flame as hell. So I probably will rock this because I like the Seminoles. I like the story of how Seminoles actually like kicked a major ass and were the only Native American tribe not to be relocated because they were badasses. So that's really cool. So happy about having this jacket for sure in the collection. Holy banana muffin fire. Look at this Bucks jersey. Oh my god. Now this thing is sexy as hell. This is a freaking memorial to Bambi's father right here before he got murked out in the woods. We got Bucks right there with the dip dye like gradient tone and lettering. Mother freaking Jennings embroidered on the back. Number three embroidered right there. This is size small. It's an Adidas hardwood classic. This thing will definitely fit me really, really well. I am so thoroughly pleased with this. Like I cannot tell you enough. Thank you so much. And what's even better is that it's dead stock. Homie was looking out for your boy. Oh, dude threw in the Shack Attack jersey right here. Vintage champion jersey number 34, LA Lakers. I don't really fuck with the Lakers, but Shaq is hilarious. Big ass funny dude. Gotta love him. In the purple, yellow, and white colorway. Size 40. Size 40 jerseys fit me perfectly, so I'm definitely gonna whip this out in the summer. Maybe even throw it over a hoodie in the winter. But thank you so much, Luis. Fuck. And then as if it couldn't get any better, at the bottom of the package, homie threw in the straight up suede lobster Supras, size 12. These are the Muska 001 or Muska. I mean, look at that. It's like they killed Clifford the big red dog, put them all over this shoe frame. These are like lightly waxed red laces. You got patent leather on the red back there. Beautiful gold Supra right there in the tongue. These are size 12. These are sexy, they're vicious, and I'm gonna wear these tonight because I'm so excited about having them. So thank you so much, Luis. 
You got the clear red bottoms on deck. These are immaculate. Oh my God. Woo! So basically this concludes the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed all the pickups. I'm sorry this video was a bit all over the place, but I rarely ever do like unboxings where I straight up open products and just look at them and have an immediate reaction, which is what I was doing. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. This was a one take wonder. I just went straight through. So hopefully you guys understand that and like it. So once again, yeah, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe as I always say. Live the dream. Eat ice cream. Stay true. My can Riding ride candy blue crew. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Mr. Paul Can2. Links will be down below my nutsack. And thank you once again to the homie Mark. Big salute to you and the homie Luis. Once again, you did more than enough in terms of compensation with all these goods. I really do appreciate it. And I'm super happy to have an abundance of shit once again. Peace out, party people. And I'll catch you guys next time.